So right. what do you recommend for a bank who says, or, or credit union that says, hey, I'm going to go do my own fintech thing, right? Or I'm going to turn on, it could even just be a new lending program or a new digital offering or hemp or cannabis. It could be any of these things, but a new initiative. Yet they've got sort of a single marketing person who knows how to market a checking account, right? Uh, maybe even to your point, maybe even more like a seg where they've been so focused on what they've been doing. This is something new. How, how does Omni Commander, how, how do you think about it in terms of helping them to sort of open up that horizon, you know? Yeah. So, you know, getting back into the messaging. So once you've identified who that target market is, um, you know, I think it's important in that messaging that you need to really develop a unique value proposition, right? So for your bank that was at that conference, hell, they were the only bank there, right? So they would have a very unique proposition as opposed to everybody else that was uh, exhibiting there. But, you know, if, if we're talking about somebody trying to go out there and market into those channels, you know, you, you, there's multiple different marketing channels that any financial institution should be using, right? And it, and, it, and it should be centered around what the unique audience is or what that target audience is. So, you know, if you know that your target audience is spending a lot of time on Instagram, then I would spend time there as well. If it's more of a, if it's a different generation, maybe it's Facebook, maybe it's TikTok. Um, I think that it's important once you understand your target audience to get messaging out there to use multiple different mediums, right? So it's not just always digital. It can be traditional. It can be billboard. It can be radio. It can be TV. It can be paid, you know, organic type of media. There's, there's so many different channels out there and some of them are really effective to move certain types of products and some of them absolutely not, right? Uh, so, you know, I think it's important to to set those types of parameters up front before you just start trying. Because you can go out and spend a whole bunch of money on paid media and get nothing for it if you don't have it focused correctly. And another big miss that I see with a lot of the, the folks are they're not really setting what their goals are. So they don't ever know if they hit success or they miss it by a large margin. One of the things that we talk about internally here at Omni Commander all the time is an X to Y by Z. And what I mean by that, Justin, is... X is where they're at now. So let's say it's a hundred million dollar credit union, right? And I say, hey, strategically, what is your goal? And they say, well, we want to grow to be a hundred and ten million dollar credit. Union. Great. So I've already got two of those filled out. X is a hundred million. They want to grow to a hundred and ten million. That's the Y. And then the next question is when, right? Uh, we want to do that by this time next year. And I'll say, okay, then that's the Z. So they're at a hundred million. They want to go to one hundred ten million, and they want to do that in twelve months. So I've got all three of my my blanks filled in, and then we can start to work around those parameters. Then you got to be careful because somebody might say, well, we're $100 million, and we want to go to $300 million, we're going to do that by next month. And then we say, okay, you don't... you don't Sign me up for that one. I'll take yeah, it. You need, <laughs> you need a magician or something, right? So that's so you also have to make sure that you know the goals are aligned between your various different partners and that it's it's things that you can move the, the needle on. But, yeah. but getting those goals, I think, is very, very important. So... Uh, when you're when you're going out into those new channels, and it doesn't have to be big goals either for for something that's net new. If you're trying to gain five new customers with a particular program, you know at the end of the month, then you you know where that is, and you can define: Do we make it? Is it successful, or is it not? 